Today we are talking about just how quickly Palantir could catch up to technology behemoths like Microsoft, Apple, and Nvidia. For more videos on Palantir technologies, remember to press the like button, subscribe if you are new, and now let's get right into the video. The shift driven by advancements in artificial intelligence has significantly transformed the market since the start of last year. The speed at which the leading entities in the AI domain have climbed the ranks of the world's most valuable companies has been astonishing. Apple has ceded the top position to Microsoft, yet both companies currently boast market capitalizations exceeding $3 trillion and $300 billion. As NVIDIA's graphics processing units became the preferred hardware for managing AI workloads, the chipmaker surged to surpass a value of $3 trillion. Although it briefly held the top spot, NVIDIA now holds the third position. Alphabet, Amazon, and Meta platforms, each a pioneer in the AI revolution, report market capitalizations of $2 trillion and $200 billion, $2 trillion, and $1 trillion and $200 billion, respectively. While Palantir Technologies has a market capitalization of just $58 billion, it is not an exaggeration to suggest that it is a strong contender for future inclusion in the trillion dollar club. Investors need only observe the rapid adoption of generative AI to grasp the magnitude of the opportunity Palantir is addressing. Though Palantir only recently caught the attention of AI investors, the company has a long and distinguished history of developing AI tools. Initially, its business focus was on assisting various agencies within the United States intelligence community to connect their legacy databases, share information, and analyze it to uncover potential terrorist plots more effectively. Since then, the company has broadened its offerings to other government and law enforcement agencies, and then to enterprises, providing AI-based data mining tools that enable management to make data-driven decisions. Leveraging its extensive experience with AI, Palantir swiftly developed additional useful solutions when generative AI gained prominence early last year. The company's artificial intelligence platform is a result of these efforts. Palantir also devised a unique go-to-market strategy that has proven highly successful. To attract new clients, the company offers boot camps, where businesses can quickly develop AI tools tailored to their specific needs. These workshops enable prospective clients to collaborate directly with Palantir's engineers to tackle real-world problems. In its recent earnings call, management highlighted that 915 organizations had already participated in these boot camps, significantly exceeding the company's original plan for 500 workshops. Additionally, the time required for Palantir to finalize deals is decreasing, as once prospects experience the artificial intelligence platform, they are convinced. This robust demand is reflected in the company's performance. In the first quarter, Palantir's revenue increased by 21% year over year and 4% sequentially, reaching $634 million. A standout metric for the quarter was United States commercial revenue, which surged by 40% to $150 million accounting for approximately 24% of total revenue, driven by strong demand for the artificial intelligence platform. Palantir also achieved its sixth consecutive quarter of generally accepted accounting principles profitability, leading many to believe it is only a matter of time before the company is included in the S&P 500, potentially as soon as this year. Furthermore, the company's guidance provided additional optimism, with management forecasting full-year growth of at least 45% for its United States commercial segment. Palantir's extensive track record of AI expertise and its collaborations with both government and enterprise clients have led many customers to seek its AI solutions for their operations. One distinct opportunity not yet fully reflected in Palantir's stock price is the potential for individual countries to develop sovereign AI solutions, a trend already underway. Combined with the secular tailwinds of enterprise AI adoption, the company's vast potential becomes evident. However, this expansion will take years, if not decades, to fully materialize. According to the consensus among Wall Street analysts, Palantir is expected to generate revenue of $2 billion and $700 million in 2024, giving it a forward price-to-sales ratio of approximately 21. Assuming this ratio remains constant, Palantir would need to grow its annual revenues to around $46 billion to support a $1 trillion market cap. With its revenue growing by 21% year-over-year in the most recent quarter, Palantir would not reach the trillion-dollar threshold until 2039 at that rate. 
However, a significant variable is the company's United States commercial revenue, which includes generative AI and grew by 70% year over year in the fourth quarter of 2023 and 40% in the first quarter of 2024, with customer counts increasing by 55% and 69% respectively. These figures illustrate the rapid, albeit uneven, adoption of AI. As mentioned earlier, when Palantir reported its first quarter results, management raised its forecast for the segment, predicting growth of at least 45% for the year, and it is currently the company's primary growth driver. Furthermore, management has a history of issuing conservative guidance. If the company were to achieve average annual revenue growth closer to 40%, it could reach a $1 trillion valuation in less than 10 years. Predictions regarding the potential for generative AI have been increasing, with global management consulting firm McKinsey and company estimating the market could be worth between $2 trillion and $600 billion, and $4 trillion and $400 billion annually. If Palantir continues on its current path and capitalizes on the AI opportunity, it could achieve a $1 trillion market cap sooner rather than later. In the end, the rapid rise of artificial intelligence has reshaped the market, with major AI companies like Microsoft, Nvidia, Alphabet, Amazon, and Meta platforms seeing significant increases in market value. Palantir Technologies, although currently valued at $58 billion, has shown substantial growth and potential, particularly in its AI-based data mining tools and the artificial intelligence platform, the company has expanded its offerings from government agencies to enterprises and developed successful client engagement strategies. With robust revenue growth, particularly in the United States commercial segment, and conservative guidance, Palantir is on track to potentially reach a $1 trillion market cap within the next decade. With that being said, remember to press the like button, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you in the next video.